Noisy out there. Oh, good to be back though. Ugh, oh, buddy. Hopefully, something. I don't know. I'm tired, Dinigo. Oh, obviously, running into the door. Smell that? That is the smell of septum zinigo. <laughs> or perhaps sepsis? I'm not sure which. Where is he? There he is. Hello, Delvin. Oh, you're back. Mm -hmm. I have completed that bedlam, bleh, bedlam job. Bleh. And here's the spoils. Bloody more where this came from. So what's next? Well, it appears your actions are starting to make waves out there. People are talking about the guild again. In fact, I just got a special job requested. I haven't gotten anything like that in years. A uh, special request? Like what? Got word from Torsten Cruelty in Windell that a rival guild is trying to get itself started. Not only that. But they're giving us thieves a bad name by murdering their marks. Get over there and see what you can do. Hmm. Thorsten Krulsi Windhelm. Got it. Uh. Anything else on the side, or is it just that? Slow down. You have that special request in Windhelm to finish first. After that's done, I'll send you some more jobs. Okay, sounds good. Where are you off to? There's work to be done. I'm off. Windhelm. Hmm. Delvin, that last shipment we heisted on the Cyrodiil frontier was worthless. Is it possible? Is that you, Brainerd? I distinctly heard that loud. Good to see you, lass. How are things? This one did not recognize you with the hood up. Now go and make us some Idiot. coin, lass. Hmm? Go ahead. Not furs. It was a damn logging caravan. Oops. Okay. It's done. Let us go. Sleep. Probably. Sleep sounds like a good idea right at the moment. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Ooh, we've been kind of all over the place. Um. The only rats I smell here scurry on two legs. <laughs> if you need anything, e excuse me, my friend. Oh no, it is okay. Hmm. It is okay. I am just glaring because I have not slept. <laughs> Although, we made a good lot, a good bit of coin in Windhelm. Surprisingly. Hmm. Huh, this one thinks that perhaps. I could have left. He's dark. Beautiful baubles and gleaming gemstones over here. I may get no sleep tonight, we will see. I was just going to say, uh, the ledger indicates that perhaps we have better average um, selves, sales? Hmm, sales. In Windhelm than in Solitude, which is weird. The man came by at noon just like you said. I gave him the package and he gave me this pouch for you. The package was heavy. I needed his help getting it on his horse. Uh, hey, I told you not to ask any questions. Now here. Jewelry, I could have left it. This place is full of um shady people. Not like this is one uh, th this one is going to be talking, but eh. Uh, hello? Hey, Izzy. How are you gonna go? 
Uh, what are you doing here? Did Iona let you in? Don't know if you've noticed, but your house Carl is out celebrating the Dragonborn's victory. Oh, that is what that's all about. Indeed. Come on, pull up a chair. Or, well, I mean it is your house. Eh, uh, yes, but... Uh, hey, Inigo, could you uh, give us some room? Go keep Iona busy or something? Good idea. Sorry for barging in like this, see? Oh, it's no problem. You are always welcome here, you know. It's a little bit weird having a house to myself. I can imagine. So, to business. Business? Sneaky business. I took care of that moron with the big contract. He left your payment in a drop box, so I picked it up for you. Twenty thousand gold. I also found a bow for you, in case you need a better one. Ebony. I think the smith up at Shore's Stone would know how to improve it if Balamin doesn't. Oh, this is too much, Ingrath. This is way too much. You did good work. I'm proud of you. And the other matter. I didn't tell you about the Dawnstar Sanctuary last time. Up around the cliffs to the northeast of Dawnstar, there's a Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. It's our new home base. I'm not sure if you have any interest whatsoever in being an assassin, but there it is. Of course I am. You're the leader now, right? The listener? That's me. Well, as long as you run it better than Astrid did. Besides, even if I'm just a sneaky speedy courier between the Dark Brotherhood and the Thieves Guild, I'm still part of the family, no? You are. You'll always be family to me, Z. Oh. Oh, speaking of sneaky business, Delvin just gave me a job. I, uh, may need some backup with it. Oh? Apparently there's some rival guild up in Windhelm that's killing their targets and giving us true sneaky Kodashi a bad name. I can probably handle the talking to people and whatnot, but what say you we go take down a guild together? Just like old times. Gonna bring in a go along? Nah. We've been running all over the place selling potions and stealing stuff and pissing off the nerds who don't like caravans in their cities. He needs a break, I think. And besides, he doesn't like Windhelm much. Alright. Well, let's do this smart, then. I'll head up tonight and see if I can't find a place to hunker down for the day. You rest, head up tomorrow morning and ask around, figure out what you need to figure out, and I'll come find you when the sun goes down, so long as you don't leave the city. See? You always come up with the good plans. Although, well, what if I need backup when I'm talking to people? You've been selling potions this whole time. Uh, yes? Poison a shiv and keep it on you. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I won't get into trouble. I will be a speedy Khajiit. And a careful Khajiit. Although, the guards at Windham really seem to like my wares, so... Who knows? They might actually be good backup if something goes wrong. No kidding. Oh, yes. I actually get better prices there than in Solitude, if you can believe it. Look at you. Running a business, owning a house. You're tuning in with savvy young ladies, Amari. Your mother would be proud. Or she would be very, very confused. <laughs> I would write to her if things were a little more... Uh, stable in Cyrodiil. I'm sure she's fine, but... I wouldn't want to get the courier in trouble just for me. Fair point. Although I probably should get going and let you get some rest. Mmm, one more thing before you go. Huh? You are very smiley, you have a new bow, and you smell like an enchanting table. And I know you couldn't enchant your way out of a Kuskra hove, so... Uh, well... Arden and I... Well, we had a talk, and... You are blushing. I'm not blushing, I'm a vampire. Vampires don't blush. Okay, but you have that little smile thing going on and your ears are twitching. Yeah, yeah, I, I know. But we're a thing. Or, well, we're trying to be a thing anyway. <laughs> ajo, ajo! Varn kaja to you both! <laughs> Thanks. Alright, I do need to get going, kiddo. I'll see you in Windhelm. See you in Windhelm. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> you 
look at that actually you shut on here. Let us go. Then okay. Oh look! Our friends are here. Hello, Akari! Yes, I know just what you mean. My toes are numb from the cold, more Hmm. It is going to be interesting. Oh, excuse me. Trying to get to places without in a go. It is snowing. Hmm. Have I got my cloak in the saddlebag somewhere? it is. And away we go. In the snow. And it's not snowing too badly, I suppose. Shadowmere, have you noticed I've started something a little bit more theory like? Like, unless I catch myself, I tend to say I instead of this one. Mm. This one has spent too much time in Skyrim. Okay, that's a threat. No. Oh, that's a big nope right there. Nope. Where? Where? Oh, there. Okay, we're just going to ride. Nope, 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 nope. Short stone. Hmm. I suppose I could stop and uh, see if that one guy will work the bow, but no. We are just going to go. Ah. Dragons are scary. This one is alone. That's a bear. Eek. Eek! Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Shadowmir. Did not mean to spook you. <laughs> Azura. Okay. I think I just heard that the dragon land behind me somewhere. Why did I decide to do this on a horse? As you know, the dragons will see the horse. They may or may not see a tiny little gadget. Uh, now which way? Hmm. We can go one of two ways. We are going to go uh, this way. This one is going to get very, very... Oh, hello, bear. Bored and lonely? Because we do not have any companions. Then again, I don't really want to bring in the goat to Windhelm again. Because, you know, he does not like Windhelm much. Mm. Oh, hello, puppies. <laughs> That's a big dragon. Eek. It's a really big dragon. Okay, we're gonna go this way. Oh, hello. Uh. Hmm. Uh, it's a nope. It's a nope, nope, nope. 
Nope, 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 nope. That's a uh, mammoth. Oh, that looks like an angry mammoth a little bit. Yeah. Uh, you might want to move, sir. Huh. This one thought he was going to get charged by an angry mammoth. I know how to use that. <laughs> Hello! Picking some flowers along the road. Using bushes. Does Inigo have my... Mm, I think Inigo has my... Merchant stuff. So, it looks like I'm just going to be arriving in Windhelm, just being me. Which, you know... I would be more concerned about that, except that I know that Ingrath is going to be there somewhere. Hopefully... Cuz... Cuz, yeah... <laughs> Windhelm is a dangerous place and I don't want to be there alone. Especially since, you know... The butcher is still somewhere because uh, gosh, it's screwed up. Oh, it's cold. Mm -hmm. Okay, you stay here. Good. Uh, uh, girl boy horse thing. Shadow Mirror does not need such. Constructs, these one things. Uh, are you? You're actually uh, the person I'm looking for, Mister Torsten. Hollyfrost Farm outside the city. It's honest work, if a bit dull. Hmm. Uh, Delvin said you had a job for me. My daughter Fiotli. She was murdered a few months ago. Left her laying on the ground in a pool of her own blood. I assumed they were after her valuables. She always wore far too much jewelry in public. Then I told her it'd be the death of her. I never thought. Hmm. I assure you it was not anyone from the guild. Our guild, anyway. No need to explain. I'm well aware of your guild's methods. It took me weeks. But I finally tracked down to kill her. A bloody Altmer at that. Can you imagine? Mm, yes. What happened to him? Let's just say I'm a firm believer in an eye for an eye and leave it at that. He fancied himself a thief in some sort of new guild forming around here. Gave me some valuable information before... Well, you know. Oh. So what exactly do you need this one to do then? Well, like I told Delvin, I think we can help each other. You recover what I'm looking for. And take out a rival guild in the process. Mm hmm. Something they took from Fiordly, I assume? Exactly. One of the pieces stolen from her was a silver locket, a cruel sea family heirloom. I want it back. Deal. Where does this one begin? The only name I have is Naranya. Has a house right here in Windhelm. That's where you should begin looking. Hmm. Should have been an adventurer like you instead of a farmer. Heh. <laughs> Just be careful of arrows in knees and whatnot. Naranya. This one thinks she knows a Naranya. I think. Probably. Question mark. <gasps> this one was about to say I have not heard that tune before, but I have. It was very good, thank you! Anyway... Uh... Psst. My father says we need to just get on with our lives. Like it's that easy. <laughs> this is not a very good day to talk about this, it seems like, but... 
yes. Can I help you with something? Perhaps. Uh, this one is here about Fiotli. 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 Where have I heard that name? Oh, of course, the poor girl who was murdered. Such a There's someone standing behind me. A tragedy, to be certain. Uh. No offense, but you are not a very good actress. How dare you! You're accusing me of taking part in such a. Such a heinous act? I should have you arrested for even suggesting such a thing. Mmm. Now I don't really want to make a scene. Especially since there is someone standing right behind me. But uh, you may want to drop this act before you make a scene yourself, you know? I'm afraid I have absolutely no idea what you're speaking of. Eh. I mean, I could get ugly if you want me to, but, um... Now, just a moment. Let's think about this, you know, discuss it like two rational people. Okay. This one is listening. Look, I had no choice. They're crazy. I could be killed. Who's crazy? It's a guild of Ultima Thieves. They call themselves the Somerset Shadows. Their leader, Linway, he's the worst of the lot. He steals valuables from the dead. Uh, you mean he murders his marks, right? He doesn't go to tomb plundering or whatever it is. No, Linwe prefers stealing from the deceased. Digs up the corpses, breaks into the hall of the dead. Oh! He even stole that locket right off that poor murdered girl's body. Or what was left of it. Uh, that explains some things. How did you get involved? I used to fence for the Thieves' Guild in Skyrim a long time ago. Uh -huh. When Linway moved into the area, he contacted me and said if I didn't fence for them, he'd kill me. Okay. Uh, this one has a certain set of skills. Could you tell me where he's hiding, perhaps? If I tell you, you need to promise not to kill me. Kill you? I'd prove to be quite an asset to the Thieves' Guild. I'm one of the best fences in Skyrim. Nah, this one would not kill you. Uh, excuse me, sir. Mm. Um, 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 I... Uh, okay. This one thinks this man behind me is a little bit drunk. Uh, just, I'm just gonna scooch. I was more thinking of taking care of him, not you. Linway is holed up in a place called Uttering Hills Cave. He's got his entire guild there, so be careful. Mm -hmm. After you're done with all this, come back any time and I'll, I'll make good on my end of the bargain. <laughs> Thank you. This one will be on her way. I'm Expeditiously. I misled you. Return oh. when this is over and Excuse we'll me. talk about my involvement in the Thieves' Guild. There's mm -hmm. no glory Part of the need. Watch what you're doing. It's just I something they tell soldiers so they'll risk their lives. And... Uh, huh? could you two move, please? You, uh, it, this one is a little bit claustrophobic. And this is much, very much a cluster. They <laughs> Thank you. Call me a war hero. <laughs> I'm no hero. Just the soul. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Uh, now I am supposed to wait for uh, Mr. Kamen until nightfall, which is <laughs> ways away. What is a carriage supposed to do in Windhelm until nightfall? Hmm. Is it Murdoch? I think it's Murdoch. Whatever his name was. I made my What's fortune your name as a again? sea captain. What are you looking retired. at? Your armor, it's amazing. You are the one who with the mm. Okay, we're out. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. It is not quite 
night time, but it is snowing. The divine smile on those who show mercy and charity. Oh yeah. I remember you. Your name is Silda, right? I'm glad to see you. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. And um the pickpocketing things maybe up to no good are we i'll teach you but it'll cost you that's okay this one has a little bit of gold lying around uh how about more hello thank you for your help silla this one is a bit dense sometimes when it comes to the finer points of being dexterous. The claws do kind of get in the way a little bit. Come visit again sometime. This one will uh think about it. Hey, kiddo. <laughs> How do you sneak up on people like that? I ask only for a little charity. I gave you a little charity. Uh, uh are you ready to go? I am, if you are. Spare a coin for a poor old woman. Oh, don't listen to her. I just give her a lot of gold for training, actually. Let's go. You seem a little nervous. Hmm. So. Do I? I'm definitely not a little nervous. I'm a lot nervous. <laughs> Semantics. Well, this one uh, got kind of cornered earlier by uh, uh, oh by the way are you okay out this with with this in this hour it's snowing it's a little uncomfortable but i'll deal with it okay uh yeah Gajit got cornered a little bit earlier and uh it was a little <laughs> nervous making now where are we going Ring Hills Cave. Do you know where that is? No idea. Apparently I've been there before. So I technically know where we're going. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so... Yes? You and Arden? Yes, me and Arden. Mm. Mm. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it! You didn't know anything. Oh, yes I did! <laughs> Gosh, he knows many things. Some say that Thalmor grabbed him. It wasn't long before I found myself under Ulfric's ban. Uh, We're running out of bread. I hope the supplies get there soon. You must be all right if you've got time. <sighs> this one is not particularly... Like the idea of wandering around in Windhelm. East March, whatever. In the snow. At night. You can see the dark, can't you? Well, yeah, but it's not great. It's... You can see in the dark, though. I can. And we can both smell in the dark. That doesn't change anything. <laughs> we can both smell in the dark. Well, just like old times, except the... Uh, not quite. think about going back to Bruma and just laying into the... Hello! Oh! Oh, thank you! You've already lost! Nicely done. 
Uh, are you okay? That guy was kind of in your face. Yeah. I need to be a bit more careful about that. Mm-hmm. Ooh. So, uh... Sneaky. Sneaky is a good idea now, huh? Yes, very much so. What were you going to ask? Uh, this one was going to ask if you ever thought about going to Bruma and just... ...stuff. Are you sure you're okay? Yes. Has a... You, you've got a... Eh. Let's see, you've got a little blood on your stuff there, but... Eh. That could honestly be from anything, knowing you. Oh, that reminds me. Let us be... Let us be smart about this. Hmm. <laughs> that seems like a good idea. Let us see. Oh. <laughs> I was just thinking about old times and whatnot. I'm thinking about the recent cat and Northag and everyone else and and Einar, which is how I know about Arden. Oh. Is someone there? <gasps> Definitely not. Oh, I missed. Hello. <laughs> I'm having what they call in the industry performance anxiety. Stage fright? Something like that. Just because I'm here? Mm hmm. There we go. Getting into the swing of things. Ooh. My nose thinks you smell like a corpse. Except that you are not a corpse and you don't really smell like a corpse, you just, you know, you don't have the distinct aroma of somebody who is actually alive. Which is fine, you know. Uh, we, we can't all be... Living. Shh. Never change, Z. Never change. This is where we came in. Excellent. He <laughs> came in. Why did I ever think that was a good idea? What? Came in? Yes. Uh -huh. It meant something to you at the time, no? True. It's a very easy name to twist, though. Warm in here. Warmer. Hi. Oh. This is why 
Maybe keep our ears open. This one's an idiot, don't worry about it. Is someone there? Oh, yes. I believe we're going in. Oh, he's behind me. Okay. Sometimes you've just gotta get in and get your hands dirty. You got impatient, didn't you? No. Maybe. Oh, there it is. Ooh. I like your hood, sir. I'm going to take his armor, too. Yeah. Simply because I might be able to work it into something else. <sighs> okay. I have an idea. Well, this is a weird idea. Yeah. Come on. This is supposed to do like fiery things. Hmm. He does not do fiery things. Sadly? Hatchet! Is this one have a torch? Torch. Mm hmm. This one is trying to set this on fire. This is a very flame-resistant material. Okay. You better be careful where you're swinging that thing. Mm-hmm. And... This one does not know any fire spells. Damn. Okay. Perhaps you can find something around here somewhere that actually does fire stuff so that I can melt that. Because frankly, this one would not like to have, um... I'm going to sell that. A thingy. The flag thing hanging around. Because it's just... Why? <sighs> hmm, hmm, hmm. Do you know any fire spells in Wrath? Technically, yes. Any that I can cast without injuring myself? No, not so much. Best. Hmm. Well? Uh oh. Well, that'll do. As you, Tragi Zari. It's a tongue twister, that one. Oh, actually, let me take that. Also, that. What'd you find? This one found a thingy. 
<sighs> this one is really bad at magic, but here we go. Okay, stand back, my friend. Oh. There we go. <laughs> you may be resistant to actual flames, but when it comes to magic... Heh. That's, uh, warm. He, yeah, let's get out of here. Or it burns you, because that would be bad. This one would not like to have... Okay. To have her uh, mentor be burning and whatnot. Excuse me. There's nothing here. I have questions. It would be a dungeon, I think. Hmm. That would do it. Okay, so that was... Um, not what this one was expecting. A little bit anticlimactic. You've gotten quite good. I'm impressed. <laughs> Alright, we've got to go this way. You really think so? I do. I only taught you so much. That is true. Well, that's what I was going to ask. If you ever thought about going back to Bruma and... Trying to track down Thorina. Uh, I've thought about it, but... I don't think it's likely to happen. Oh? Too many memories. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. What about you? You ever thought about it? I... I mean... Kind of? Well, there's a lot to do in Skyrim, so I'm just still here. They wouldn't want to do that alone either, because, you know... Tiny Kashi liable to get squished. Or stabbed or shot or something. Fair point. It is very much past Kajit's bedtime. You know... Oh. Considering how well you handled them... I may have a request for you. Huh? Would you like to be a silencer? What? What do you mean? Well, I'm not quite sure what rank you had before Astrid kicked it. Uh, I didn't know there were ranks. Right. Square one. Hmm. Well, I was thinking, since... You kind of have your own business with the Thieves Guild and whatnot. You're likely not to be at the Sanctuary very often. True. Coming over here so that I can keep an eye on the road, um, cause... yeah. Understandable. I figure... If you want to stay in the Brotherhood, you should probably have a fitting job when that takes you... 
you know, all over Skyrim and doesn't necessarily have you running back to Dawnstar and whatnot. Mmm, that seems like a good idea. So, silencer? Yes. Basically, if we have a problem, or something to take care of in-house, as it were, we call on you, and you take care of the problem. Ooh. This one could do that. Maybe perhaps Babette would be better at it, but... Mm. Sure. I might need Babette to be just regular training kind of person. Or a speaker. Something like that. I'm still working the kinks out. Got it. And of course you are the sinner, so... You get to, uh... You get to be in charge of all of the things. Correct. Recruiting among them. Can't tell you how much I'm not looking forward to that. We'll get it back on its feet somehow. One way or another. Oh, I could talk to Delvin for you. About what? Uh, well, apparently he owed Astrid... He, he gave Astrid an IOU for that necklace thingy. Okay. So, if I talk to him, maybe he will, you know, extend some goodwill to you. Even though he's probably never met you before in his life or yours. That might be a good idea, actually. Yeah, okay. So I am the silencer now. <laughs> Not very silent for a silencer, am I? Uh, no, but that is kind of the listener's job, being silent. Well, then you have a perfect... Uh, you, you're doing good. <laughs> okay, we're standing around in the cold, freezing our butts off. Uh, should, should, uh, I have to go back to Riften. Yes. Mm. I also want to see where the sta where the sanctuary is, but, oh! Fireworks. This one is guessing that she will have plenty of opportunity to stop by in the course of her many, 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 many jobs. I can't remember if I have something to do for Vex. See, this is why I'm asking you to be a silencer rather than an executioner. Hmm? You have enough on your plate already, and we don't have enough enemies to warrant it yet. Ah. I see. Kind of, I think. Either way, I accept this, um, promotion, I think, maybe, I guess. Oh, okay. Um, thank you for, uh, tagging along. You know, I didn't end up needing your help much at all. Hmm. I trained you well. And you have expanded on that knowledge in ways I couldn't have possibly imagined. So, consider me proud. Ye I should probably let you get going to wherever you're going before the sun starts coming up again. That's probably for the best. Okay. I will be seeing you. Uh, say hello to Arden for me, I guess? <laughs> I will. I've got to get back to the sanctuary first, though, so... I'll give Nazir your regards first. Thank you. I promise to stop by at some point in the near future, but first I've got to get back to Riften and turn this stuff in and whatnot. So, I will see you around. See you around. Take care of yourself, alright? E. This one will. <sighs> anyway. I will give you a hug or something, but... Don't worry about it. Hmm, okay, bye! I'm not good at saying goodbye. I wonder why he left his horse. He's been near around somewhere. Whoop, keep, whoop, eh, whoop. Oh.